This is Carl Eller, and you're watching the One Bar and Lepicas Show. All right, welcome back to the One Bar and Lepicas Show. I am One Bar. It is Saturday, which means it is time to bust out our WinView Games predictions. As always, hit up the link right here. Download WinView Games using the One Bar and Lepicas link. Uh, we all live and breathe Minnesota Vikings. Put that knowledge to the test one of the best ones out there as far as live and pregame prop contests. Uh, first 100 bucks, they match. It is a no-brainer. Hit up the link, download it, give us your ID so you can hop in and see how we're doing. Um, but it's great. Every week, they change up the questions based off of the game, based off who they're playing. And uh, you, win, can, you can win some money. And damn it, I have won some money. So let's check it out. This week, uh, this week's a little, little tougher for me because we do not still know 100% if Dak Prescott is going, which has a lot to do with some of these but let's just get right into it these are the vikings cowboys prop contests let's start off with number 10 both teams combined to score 53 or more points in the game uh yeah i'm i think even if dak doesn't play i think there's gonna be a lot of points scored in this game hopefully a lot of points for the vikings i'm very confident in this i am going yes 750 absolutely making that prediction let me know in the comments below where i am really screwing up of what you would have done different but hopefully you downloaded it and did it differently on your end next question adam thielen records more receiving yards than mari cooper hmm. I'm gonna go yes i think cd lamb if this was cd lamb I'd, I'd go no but uh more than amari cooper yeah i'm going middle of the road 500 either team records a single offensive play that gains 50 or more yards in the game so only one of the teams has to do it. I think the Vikings' longest play this year is like 60-some yarder to, to K.J. Osborne. Other than that, I don't think they got anything over 50 yards, but, but the Cowboys sure the hell do. So I'm going to go yes. One of those teams will bust one of those out. No Patrick Peterson. Cowboys pass defense still not overly fantastic. Each team records at least one rushing touchdown. Yeah. Yeah. Dalvin. Zeke, absolutely. Justin Jefferson records more receptions in CD Lamb. Receptions. I'm going to say yes. Again, I think CD Lamb probably will have more yards, uh, but Jefferson will get more receptions. I'm going 750. Damn right. Feeling good. Confidence is high. Dallas passes for more total yards than Minnesota in the game. Going to go no just because I. if, if Dak was playing, I, I would be more confident to go yes, but I'm going to go no. Each team makes at least one successful field goal, 40 more yards. Yeah, I'm going to go yes every time. Greg Joseph, damn right, he's going to make some. Uh, this is both each team makes it. I'm still going yes. A lot of points. Both Dalvin McCook and Zeke each score at least one touchdown in the game. I'm going to go yes on this based off of the last one in the middle. The longest offensive play is a rushing play. No, not doing it. I think there's going to be a lot of yards through the air. I'm going 750 on that. A lot of, lot of yards through there. Who wins the game? I've said this before. In the win v ones, I'm always going to pick Minnesota every damn time. Come game prediction, I'm going to get a little more serious. But anytime I do fantasy, anytime I do any predictions for money, I always got to do Minnesota. 500. There we have it. Those are our, or Those are my predictions. Hit up the link right here, download the app, let me know what your predictions were, and uh, we'll be back later.